So, Saturday night game here at the Peter Rice Arena. Phantoms, first game of the weekend against the Bracknell Bees. Oh, and here we go. Looks like we have a, a bit of a start of the game. Ding dong, Nicky Watt and Thomas Jeffrey. And uh, both teams looking, they got hold of each other. Jeffrey gets the first win over the top, and Je Watt has gone down. He's back up, though, back on his feet, and now he's punching Jeffrey in the head. They're both down on the knees. Jeffrey can't see. Jersey's covering his head up, can't see. Watt's going in, full blast. In fact, Watt's giving a pretty good account of him. Poor old Jeffrey's getting it thick here there at the moment, but he's coming back at him and one over the top with the left. He's down on his knees. He's back up again, and what Jeffrey's down, and I think. Sadly, that's a Nicky Watt win. It's a good effort by both parties. And they pat each other the back. They'll get to a few minutes in the, uh, in the box. It looks like old Thomas Jeffrey's got a bit of a cut to the nose. And... Uh, One of the things I think in this league, they because uh, it's supposed to be a development league, they don't have fight straps on the shirts. And uh, there you go. Well, we start again. Ten seconds in. Watt runs it along to Randall. He gets gets it out, but Dwayne Newman has to chase back and pick it up. And uh, of course, both teams now back up to full strength. Be not Peterborough not making anything of that first power player of the night James Morgan back to Jeff Glower off he goes Glower just skirts round Watt and Chesky into the middle there and it's a goal Zedins gets on the end of it but a great work by Glower just cruising through the Bracknell defence and leaving it to Maris to pop it away I think it was Maris it out and pinches being a little bit uh, physical this evening, so. <laughs> Glower goes after him. Zedin's rifles win in from just inside the halfway line, and Ambler keeps it covered. Now it's Murray Zedins running forward, tipped on by Joe Miller, and Glower's going to have to go chasing after it. Zedins keeps it in. Jeff Glower now. Glower, a little bit of space back to Zedins. Got Miller now. Oops, Miller falls over. That's Zedins round the back of the boards there. Carl on in the middle is James Hutchinson. Just w plenty of space waiting for the puck to come in. He could rifle a shot in from there. Maris Zedin still with it. A minute and a quarter left. Forced to do some sneaky stick work. Glow around the back of the goal. They're just not passing the puck around quite snappily enough. Back to Hutchinson. Hutchinson now hadn't got no space. The puck knocked in. Still loose around the back there. And Carr Glower finds the back of the net. As uh, Ambler was fishing around on his knees. And Peterborough... It has to be said that Bracknell are not looking the tightest tonight. Carlon has a go straight into the legs there of Glower. Glower back to Carlon. Another shot in from Carlon. 3 0 Peterborough. 2 17 left on the clock. Even handed this time. Things looking a little bit. Not too bad for Peterborough. Yardley and Garcia. It's the bees who get the draw. Win the face off. Peter Jazik now down that right left hand side. Comes off wall. Spur with it. He turns back towards his own end. And Jazik picks the puck away from him. Strips it off him. It's it in the middle there. It's a goal. Pinch got on the end of it. Peterborough fannying around. And with 0.2 of a second on the clock. Wall left an open goal. Nicky up, pulls away. Chesky goes for the face off with Warren Tate. Down he goes. 
Ferrara comes in, gets it to Tate. Tate now oh, in the corner there. Knocks it around to Lelanus. Lelanus grabs a little bit of space. Shoots that in from what a tight angle. And it goes in that top right hand corner of Ambler's goal. Peterborough 4, Bracknell 1. That's Lelanus with it now. Tries to. Ooh, stick it in. Luke Ferrara gets another go, and now it's Warren Tate. Lelanus in front, he's going to have a go to see if he can sneak it through the legs, but it doesn't quite get it on target. Deflected away. Morgan knocks it back. Lelanus picks it up, opens up a little bit of the space into the middle there to Newman. It's a goal! Dwayne Newman don't get many. He loves that. 5 1 Peterborough. <laughs> that'll be his first of the season if I'm not mistaken by Miller and Spur Oof. crikey me I felt that oh and off they go again it's another fight Miller and Galazzi going for it Galazzi sort of just holding him he doesn't look like he wants to fight particularly but it's more of a sort of a cuddle at the moment. Oh, God only knows what they're up to. <laughs> Off they go again. Chesky up the middle there. Uh, was that not offside? Well, maybe the linesman didn't think so. He probably got a better view of it than me. That's uh, Pinch. Back to Chesky. Chesky fires one in. It trickles through the legs of Wall and they pulled one back then. Palakowski up the middle to Spearing. Spearing, can he get by Zedin? Zedin slows him down. And Peterborough get it out again. But Randall turns it back. Randall again. He fires one in there. His tribe. It's a goal from Tribe and it's 5-3. All of a sudden the Bees are not so very far away. And they're pr I think they might have been back up to strength then. But uh, just as the penalty finishes. And that was number 24, Craig Tribe. Ginger lobs that one in. Spear in now, gets battered into the boards by I don't know what's going on down there, but it's it's neither one thing nor the other, is it? A sort of a uh, half-hearted pushing and shoving. The referee kind of letting them get on with it, sort of thing. Well, off the glass, up over the top of Maris Zedin. Zedin's in the middle there to Tom Carlon. And pokes it round past the side of the goal. Out of the uh, B's end, it comes all the way back into the Peterborough end. It's uh, Dwayne Newman with it. <laughs> Tom Carley, the Middle East Jeff Glower. It's a goal! Fired it through, uh, sneaked it between the goalie and the post. Peterborough make it six with two minutes to go. That's Chesky, a clock ticking down. Fires it along. And the buzzer goes, end of the game then. Peterborough wins 6-3.
against the Bracknell Bees. Tomorrow will be a different kettle of fish as they face league leaders, Manchester Phoenix.